he is maybe the best bet for your entertainment dollar at the moment. Like, you think about all sports, who's going to give you better bang for your buck right now? Trade in your vehicle and get it. I wouldn't be able to get a 15 Dodge Charger. Thousand sport clip locations out there. Hey, honey, I know we said we weren't ready to buy a home yet. Trump has so much more. You got Willie Monroe this weekend. Yeah. Poor Willie. But <laughs> Willie Monroe is a very slick. good boxer. Not a big puncher, but very slick southpaw. Right. He's a great boxer. And I need, I need to show my fans I, need, I can't beat any style. Last time you fought in LA. Uh, you scored a knockout, you called it Mexican style. You basically dedicated it to the Mexican fans. Your coach, Abel Sanchez, taught you how to fight basically like Julio Cesar Chavez Sr., right? That's I've even right. talked to Julio Cesar Chavez about you, and he's like, yeah, he fights like I used to fight. So when you okay. see an oh, opponent well, like that, Willie that second, coming at you, is it already in your head how you want to attack him? Or do you go into the moment and see what his game plan is? Now, so many fighters, you notice they follow the other guy around when he moves. The way Pacquiao followed Floyd around instead of sliding over and cutting off the ring. I'm sure Abel Sanchez has been working with you on cutting off the ring. Can you exactly. talk about that a little bit? Exactly. Nice. Just, yeah, first of all, thank you for my coach, Abel Sanchez. With 19 knockouts in a row, defending his middleweight title against number two rated Willie Monroe Jr. at the Forum on May 16th. beat Martinez, so he's yeah. the champ. Exactly. And you are not going to be satisfied until you have erased any doubt that you are the champion. Right. right. So you want Cotto because he beat Martinez. Yes. My goal is all the belt. One season. Okay, maybe Cotto, maybe Canelo, he come in 160. Of course. I, I want, I want fight with champions. 